Okay, well, how about the event on Saturday? You kind of have an idea about wind? Weather-wise, yeah, the winds will be around 5 to 15 miles per hour. Temperatures near 80. It should be great weather. Uh, NT, great with Park on Saturday. All right. Well, thank you so much, Aaron. I appreciate it. Yeah. And I'm sure the folks at this kite event also appreciate it as well <laughs> because this laser focus we have on weather is all because we want to make sure that the 24th annual Kids and Kites event is an absolute success. So let's not waste any more time. My co-host Mercedes Wilson live at Gretwood Park this morning, ready to harness that wind. Mercedes, how's the weather? Oh my gosh, we are having a great time. The weather is perfect out here at Gratwick Riverside Park. And I'm here with Benjamin Bunker. Benjamin, uh, you're gonna show me how to fly this a little later, right? A little bit, yeah, <laughs> we'll get to it. But first we have to talk about September 17th, there is a great event, Kids in Kites, happening mm -hmm. here, right here at Gratwood Park. Tell us a little bit about it. Yep, so Saturday, September 17th, uh, it's the 24th annual Kids and Kites, mm -hmm. and our first at Gratwick Riverside Park. We're very excited to be here. Uh, the first 500 youth get a free kite, free t-shirt, and a free hot dog lunch. So it's a great- Kids get a free kite. Yes, if you if you look behind us, you see all of these beautiful kites flying. Can you speak to the organization that is yeah, flying these kites? As absolutely. Well? This is the Great Lake Kite Flyers Association. Mm -hmm. uh, they're part of the American Kite Flyer Association. So they're a great uh, great or local organization that comes out and flies these these giant kites mm -hmm. down here at Riverside Park, Gretwick Park, and uh, it's a really cool spectacle to see. Oh yeah, and we have to. We absolutely have to mention them because it's inspiring and it's taking me back to my childhood <laughs> and it's going to take us back to the event because further behind these kites mm -hmm. is the pavilion where the event will take place. Talk about that, some of the festivities that will be taking place. Absolutely. So registration will be at 11 a.m. Uh, it goes to, we our, the event goes from 11 to 2. So at the, at the event, we have uh, entertainment. I mean, obviously, we have free food, kite flying but we have great entertainment. Uh, there'll be uh, Nels Ross, he's an entertaining juggler. Uh, uh -huh. There's a ton of grant prizes that we're really excited about. Uh, we're gonna raffle off about seven bikes oh, at the end of so the cool. event. So again, it's 11 to 2 uh, p.m. on Saturday. And Saturday is gonna be great weather. We're talking 80 degrees. The breeze here mm -hmm. <laughs> is amazing. So you can, you can catch some wind to fly some kites here, right? Oh yeah, that's why we're excited, that's why we're excited to be here. You know, they, they, they rave about this park as a great kite flying park. And this is the 24th event. What does it mean to the youth that you, you know, guys do it's this? A, you know, I think right now it's just a great time to have a, a free outlet for an event. And you know, it's not just about, it's the youth and families. Uh, yeah. It's great to have families come together and everybody's at the same level when they're trying to fly a kite. Uh, that and I think that's the, the best part. Uh, that is very just like you said, we're we haven't flown a kite since we were little kids. So uh, when a parent is teaching a, a kid to fly a kite, it's always a, a fun teaching moment. Yes, and of course, take a moment to talk about the sponsors too, because you yes. can't do this alone. Yes, absolutely. We're so thankful for so many of our sponsors. Uh, Fidelis Care, uh, we have Berkshire Farms, Niagara Federal Credit Union. Uh, we have uh, Kiwanis Club of Lewiston, the Bonadio Group. Those are our Gold Flyer sponsors. And there's just so many more that we, we can't thank enough that help put, uh, put this event on. Uh, it comes no cost to the county or any of the youth. It just comes from our, all of the community organizations. And we're so thankful for that. Yes, and we're thankful for you. Give everyone the time again. Yep, Saturday, September 17th. Registration begins at 11 a.m. at uh, the back pavilion. Uh, and the event will go till 2 p.m. First come, first serve, the first 500 people, First right? 500 youth, yep. You wanna be here, 80 degrees, great wind, you get a kite, you get great food, entertainment, games. Mm -hmm. Ben, what am I missing? Oh, you know, live music. We'll have music uh, by DJ the DJ. He's another great sponsor, and it's a good chance to come out and see the Kite Flyers. Yeah. Uh, you want to be here. Emily? I definitely I want to the be nicest there. Way, yes. But you need to go fly a kite and then <laughs> come out. <laughs> Thanks, Mercedes. I actually take it in the nicest way. So thank you so much for that. I definitely want to take my kids. This is going to be great. We should do it as a <laughs> double family event, right, Mercedes? It's going to be great. I mean, that's awesome. And we're going to check back in with Mercedes in just we a few minutes to. because we want to see you flying a kite, Mercedes, okay?